Hello YouTubers and welcome to my channel. Today I would like to talk about John Pertwee's era on Doctor Who. So John Pertwee's era, if you do not know, is 1970, 1970 to 1974. For the like four years, he had three 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 companions. Had three companions, um, and he was the most famous Doctor. Had to have um, a James Bond theme. He had probably the most famous Doctor. I would say famous because he had the Daleks and the Cybermen. Well, he had he had little glimpses of the Cybermen. I mean, he was, he was probably the only Doctor who's never faced the Cybermen except in the Five Doctors, where he did face the Cybermen. Can you hear me? I hope you can. I'll just push you a bit closer. Because I'm running on a seat. So sorry if I'm a bit up in your face. You probably can hear me now too loudly. Um, so yes, yeah, John Pertry is the doctor I'm talking about today. Um, he has a famous cousin who's in another one of my favourite TV shows, Dad's Army. Um, he, he plays, um, what's his name? Put that light out, um, Sergeant, not Sergeant. Ward and Hodges, his cousin does, but we're going on to John Pertry, so he does have the famous monsters, he has a very peed off supreme Dalek, which is gold, and then he has a normal da gold Dalek, which is the chief Dalek, so he has the supreme Dalek, and he has the first Dalek called the chief Dalek, which we never see again, we never see the chief Dalek again, so that's a shame. Um, we have the first Orgons. Now, Orgons did come back in a really happy and um, special. Um, it's the first one we see. I mean, Series 3, for me. If you're a new Doctor Who fan, many people say start in Series... Not soon. And not, ser not Series 3. So then series 4. Because they are the first Doctor. What am I saying that for? Um, can I get the right series right? But I won't get the right series. I think series 10 and series 14, series 10 is the third Doctor, I think series 14 is the fourth Doctor, probably getting that wrong, so don't blame me, I don't know why I said that. Um, many people say if you want to go to classic, start start with the fourth Doctor, I would say start with the third Doctor, but then again many people would say start with the first Doctor, <laughs> but many people don't like black and white, many people don't like black and white. But if you really want to start off watching Doctor Who and you don't like the colour, then I would advise you to watch um, to watch the third Doctor because you watch it from the start. You had the Silurians, the Silurians who are in it now. You have the Centaurians. You've got the Master. The Master is the most. It's the first time we get the Master. The Master is fantastic. I mean, John Pertwee is great, but he, as many people say, he's like. Just imagine, I can just remember him in what's the way, where's the rummage? Um, pulling his head up. Um, yeah, what's I gonna say? Uh, the master is just fantastic. It's a shame that Roger Dalgal never regenerate. But the way the third doctor regenerates, how oh dear. At least he regenerates from really powerful blood, you know, the spiders, you know, the crystal, you know, the poison. At least it was powerful, but I mean, the giant spiders, kind of crappy, just flood the planet. That's all you need to do, flood the planet. You know, just think about how the spiders get on in the natural days. Hmm. Kind of, kind of weird, isn't it? Having spiders, fighting spiders, I don't like that. But then again, you you had you had the Silurians, Sea Devils, the Master, and some of the other monsters who are not, you know, and Daleks, and you do some sleep side men, Dras Dragics, um, Oregons, um, what else are in the third Doctors? Which well, I I say the um, I actually quite enjoyed the. Um, Asorbers, are they called Asorbers? The guys from Mars, I enjoyed that. Um, I really did enjoy that. Um, 
for the thing is, is not. Oh, I forgot the Ice Warriors. Of course, the Ice Warriors are back in this story. Um, very cool. Um, and I didn't say the uh, pa companions' names. Companions' names are Joe Grant, one of them, Sarah Jane Smith, and the first one is Miss Shaw. Miss Shaw. Miss Shaw goes to Cambridge, where I live. <laughs> Cambridge. <laughs> I don't. No, I care much. The only re I don't like that too much. The only reason why I say stuff with her is because she from Ca she goes to Cambridge. You know, she works in Cambridge. That's where I'm from, Cambridge. And she speaks so partially, like, oh my god. We don't talk like that in Cambridge. Don't worry. We don't talk like that. And then my voice sounds weird anyway. It changes. One minute I talk normal how I would usually talk, and then I hear myself back on here and I'm like, oh dear, sound weird. This one we see the Master's TP, we see Betty, Be Bessie, is it Bessie? Um, the Doctor's car, which first shows up. This, this is the first time the Doctor gets.